you know time travel isn't a real thing, right? I have traveled here, and it matters not if I understand how. A knight is sworn to valor and virtue. We'll give aid to those who seek it. Clear! Clear! Stay where you are! But I fear I must return home. Do you really think going along with this little delusion is helping a situation? Who are we to tell him he's not who he says he is? Are you sure you're not a witch? What if Cole really is who he says he is? <laughs> what if there are things beyond our comprehension? Then I would say you both need to get your heads examined. You don't have to go. I have no choice. Wherever you are, it's the only place I want to be. But no one can control their own destiny. <gasps> nice catch. Steady now, lady. This assignment could jumpstart your career. Wow. I'm actually inside the palace. This is better than an exclusive. Get lots of video, audio, whatever you can grab. Oh. Hi. Ready? Hang on! You. <gasps> you seem rather fascinated with my brother. I heard people say you didn't want to give up your lifestyle. I hope you'll come tomorrow night. Tomorrow night? The Christmas Eve ball. What's going on? Complete makeover. Oh, this is a lonely place for a king without a queen. Loyal readers, it's been 349 days since I said yes to the love of my life, Richard Bevan Charlton, King of Aldovia. Somehow, through all this insanity, I'm still me, even though I'm about to become queen of a small country. I can't get over the fact this is gonna be my home. Until the wedding, you're going to have your own bridal suite. Sweet? Wow. To plan. And I have the world's best wedding planner. See, he designs, uh, he does not plan. We have much preparation to do and very little time. I can't see. We are looking for you, darling. It's perfect. I'm looking for something more contemporary. Aldovia has the traditions. Life in a fishbowl takes getting used to. We're going to do a brilliant job. You're having some royal pains. It's like Bridezilla in reverse. Could you turn to the left? Down? Right? It's just not working. Now that you're part of the royal family, we must be careful of the image that you project. I just always thought that my wedding would be about being with the person I love. I didn't realize it meant having to give up who I am. Your wedding is about you and Richard. Everything else is secondary. I'm so sorry. We number. We number. Do you have any names to share? No. no.
I've been thinking, I want this baby to have a normal life. Our child will be heir to the kingdom. Still, I went to public school, and I was riding the subway by myself when I was 10. We'll find a new definition of normal together. But no subway riding. Well, luckily for you, Aldovia doesn't have a subway. <laughs> Tonight, your majesties will sign the truce between Aldovia and Penglia. I'll be the first queen to sign it. The Penglians are quite traditional. We, the queens, could bring the treaty up to date. You wish to modernize our 600-year-old tradition? History isn't made by those who follow rules. May I also offer our service? I have seen the artifact. It's a bit tacky. It's a priceless work of art. It is my honor to preside over the sacred truce. Let the signing begin. Well, perhaps now it can be replaced with something more palatable. Who in this palace had the means, the opportunity, the motive? If the sacred truce is broken, there will be a curse on the firstborn child. If the treaty isn't signed by midnight Christmas Eve, it takes effect. The treaty is missing, and if we don't find it, our baby is cursed. You're gonna have to explain that one. It's a long story. Emphasis on story. I'll be on the first flight in. Oh, could you please bring me some bagels? Don't judge my cravings. It's going to be fun. I don't know if I'm ready to be a queen and a mom. The plane is standing by. We'll depart a first clearing. I know you don't believe in the curse, but right now, I need your help. We'll leave no stone unturned. No one does Christmas like the Aldovians. No!